I feel like Vitafly gonna recap this and say God he caught a 30 on the dime roll. So all y'all wanna know what happened, I'm gonna tell you what happened. He got smoked. That one was crazy out of the game. Sometimes that's Peter, nobody that knows body. Hit his area with 51. Everything in the Vitafly. We used to rap it like that. Slim said. Drowning the lights while I stare. I've been on vacation too long. Nay, girl, I'm solo in here. They show me love of the year. Let champagne rain from the clouds. While she blow smoke in the air. Drowning the lights while I stare. I've been on vacation too long. I am Boston, the other half, and Enough's enough. I'm on some other stuff. I'm known for these gun rounds, but I'll put these guns down and fuck you up if I'm not. If I chase a nigga, gun break a nigga, funeral homes, box break a nigga, you get the open hand, the fist, or the deuce. Rock, 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 rock. Come out when I swing it, you get your uppercut. I grab you by your neck, you get another cut and another cut. It look like the seatbelt won't work in time. Buckle up, boy. You already know what it is, man. Salute to the subscribers, that notification gang. Make sure you subscribe to the channel to stay in tune with all the latest content, etc., etc. Don't let none of that get too far ahead of you. Salute to my guy, Showtime SP. Let's get right into it. Um, Daylight, salute to Daylight and all that he has going on musically, personally, professionally, family guy and everything else. Not family guy like Stewie, but family guy. Um, and Tay Rock, salute to Tay Rock, are going to be battling. It's been a lot of rumors, you know, people were saying this person, that person, this person. I found out late last night to early this morning that it was going to be Tay Rock, but I wasn't just going to jump out there like, oh, yo, yo, that's the, the, the Tay Rock. Um, me and Tay Rock spoke, and I spoke to Daylight. It's funny, I spoke to Daylight before I spoke to Rock. Um, Rock is my man, Daylight's my man too. I've known both for quite some time. But I've known Daylight, you know what I'm saying, like my relationship with him is different because he will jump in and jump out like I talked to him when he was about to battle Lux then I talked to him now that he's about to battle uh, Tay Rock and like he'll jump in and out we'll speak and then we won't speak then we will speak but uh, he I will tell you this for the battle with Tay Rock he's focused and he, we're gonna get daylight like we're gonna get rapping daylight shit y'all should panic you think I'm playing well I'm playing some shit that's finna stop the planet I'm bolder than any nigga in my class you telling me I shouldn't take rock for granted? Stop, Chase. You feel you the face of URL? Take this time. Now that's my space. Or I'll show you how much hands I got. With this amount, rush more than you can imagine. I'm going straight at the rock face. Think of Glacier. Tell rock chill. Think I'm looking for rubies. Get rock pills. They'll be in a hospital trying to create a mountain. You better hope them doctors can make rock hill. Have a seat, boy. That's a rocking chair. But let's switch the topics. I glock shit. I'm just a prophet who get the profit. They want to know how many shots did rock get. Allegedly, you know what I'm saying? Don't, don't, don't quote me. You know what I'm saying? Because if he if he doesn't, then I'll be up here looking crazy. You know what I'm saying? Daylight might come with a antic so big. Who knows? You know what I'm saying? He, I told Daylight. I promise you, I told him. Antics, antics. Don't hit me with the gaffle. I won't budge if you don't judge. Just don't hit me with the gavel. You moist and I, you boys could fight. You gonna break rock down to crumbles. Well, just don't hit me with the gravel. And he said that he's ready and would be prepared for their battle. Um, and I, I mean, to me, like in just the general conversation that we have, he's he's focused and he's he's saying that he's gonna rock is in some deep shit. Is what he's saying. Rock is gonna he's he's gonna smoke rock. It's what he allegedly, you know what I mean. But I, when I think of it from that perspective, I'm like, daylight don't really be known for smoking nobody. When 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 you start smoking niggas like that, huh huh huh? Um, I loved. His battle versus Chilla Jones. When I chase a nigga, Glocks break a nigga, funeral home box break a nigga. You get the open hand fist to the deuce, rock, paper, scissors. I did like that battle. And I like some other daylight battles, but I mean, he's had the antics that we know about. Um, so you take daylight who can rap with the best of them and put him in a small room with Tay Rock. And I spoke to Rock, and Rock knows, like, rocks. Anticipatory skills are amazing. Like he can anticipate what is going to happen. Like his vision and the fact that he knows that he's under pressure. People are saying he's gonna lose. 
He uses pressure makes diamonds, doesn't it? Does pressure make diamonds? Okay, okay, okay. Pressure makes diamonds, but pressure also bursts pipes. So Rock knows that he's under pressure versus daylight. He knows that. Come on. Even 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 daylight, like daylight's yeah. kind of weird. Like he's he's good. He's right. good. I ain't gonna take nothing from him, but he's like not my kind of rapper either. But I, I smoke him just because he was talking shit for Rex. Mm. And I'm kinda weird. Not in that bag. Like I'm gonna just go. And I want I want that twerk smoke. Um T stop in daylight. Even 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 daylight, daylight like daylight's yeah. Kind of weird. Like he's he's good. He's right. good. I ain't gonna take nothing from him. But he's like not my kind of rapper either. But I I smoke him just because he was talking shit for Rex, mm. and I ain't like that. If he wanted to pick sides, I'll kill him for that. <laughs> he's ass. I don't really care for daylight. But um, T Top, he knows all of the, what daylight would be able to you know utilize against him. But he said he loves this energy. He lives for it. He said I, we, when we briefly spoke, I said. The last time he really faced an immense amount of pressure in a battle, well, it was twice. Um, him versus Geechee. That was after all of the um, you know incidents that happened with the street stuff. He 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 fared well. He stood in front of Geechee, got his first round. But the, I know I'm gonna get to the fact that it's in a small room. Trust me. Hold on. You take. I don't even gotta say it. Y'all niggas know what it is. All right, cool. We've been doing this for a while now. So. He knows that he's under pressure, he knows what he's facing, he knows a lot of people feel like he's gonna lose. He does, trust me, I know that. I would I would show you, but then I don't, you know, expose our conversation. So, um, and the funny thing is, like, I, I, I can have relationships with a bunch of people, you know what I'm saying, that are battling, with people that are battling each other, and our conversations truly remain anonymous to one, you know what I'm saying? Like, we don't, we don't play them games. So, he knows he's under pressure, he knows people feel like he's gonna lose, uh, but the, he said like him versus Geechee was a big amount of pressure. He showed up in that battle, took that crazy first round, and then won the second and made the, the third was a debatable. A lot of people have rock, some people had Geechee, but whatever. The other time when he faced a lot of pressure with people, everybody was saying he was going to lose was against Hollow the Don. You got another cut, another cut, the seatbelt won't work and I'm trying to buckle up. So what he's telling me and what I'm getting is that you're going to get, people are saying that since he can't perform in a smaller room, that you're gonna get, you're gonna get Tay Rock smaller room. Now let's think of some performances that he's had in smaller rooms, uh, because when you say small room, we're not talking about the caffeine shit. They're not battling in front of a fucking the caffeine ultimate madness camera where it's just them niggas in like a couple of <laughs> in the background. That's not known. It's not known, motherfucker. I'm thinking more so like. The last volume setting where you had a group of people there, but it wasn't huge crowd. He did that versus Gluezy. He had that battle. Him and Gluezy battle was cool. That's not going to blow the roof off for me. But uh, him versus JC, that wasn't no big crowd. That was a long time ago. By the butt, I keep banging like I got my dollar stuff. That was crazy. And him versus uh, Charlie Clips Part 2. One of the last battles that Charlie Clips actually wrote for Action. Clips is my man. I tell you, this is one of the last battles he actually wrote for was him versus Rock Part Two. So I say that to say this: as bad as people may be saying Rock is in small rooms, he has the ability and knows how to rap in these rooms. Now, don't get the quarantine shit fucked up. Him and Tay Rock. Oh, I mean him and T Top. Okay, he had that battle. That was crunchy. You know what I'm saying? The performance all together. You know what I'm saying? He had the nasty uh motherfucking uh, uh, Call of Duty PlayStation headset on and shit, and then T Top had like five niggas in the back. He was like, bitch, bitch, motherfucker, what? Motherfucker, what? They killed George Floyd. Nigga, I'm wildin'. Like, he was wildin' on him like that. You know what I'm saying? He brought a stage performance to a damn uh, a, 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 a quarantine battle. You know what I mean? So, with that being said, I got this battle being very interesting. Um, I'm not going to get into like who's going to win and all that other shit. I think that I, it's, it's more deserving that I break these things down with my man Showtime SP. You know what I'm saying? That's my guy. We do. That's what we do. But, um, you know, he'll be by later because we're doing the recaps for the um, oh, some um, madness. Um, salute to all of the MCs that are on there. I hope y'all all do your thing. I'm from the Bronx, though. Let's not get it twisted. You know what it is. Lou Castro. What is what, what it do? But, um. You know, I hope these, I hope all these guys do their thing. I, I look forward to seeing um, guys put on, bring their energy, bring their A game, and remember that you rapping for twenty five thousand dollars, my nigga. Like, that's not a lot of, that's not a lot of money. Are you kidding me? 
You just die for less every day, B. But um, overall, daylight does seem focused. I mean, I mean, I mean, I mean. The last, I think the last time I seen him battle, I've seen him battle twice in person. Him versus Ill Will. Him versus Bangs. Him versus Bangs was Bang, Bangs went crazy in that joint too. But him versus Ill Will, he was prepared. And he had three rounds and he was focused. My thing is not so much daylight being prepared, because he he like he will bring rounds. He will bring crazy metaphors, lyrics, and shit like that. He can do that. It's the willingness and wantingness to perform at this level because he's got the music thing going on. He's got his clothing. He put out shirts for this joint going on right now. Um, so Daylight's got mad shit going on. Rock, this is what Rock do. Rock wants to be continuing battling. Rock wants to be in this lane. This is what he does. So I think it's different because it's a smaller room. Because if it was a big stage... I would just pick Rock and that would be the end of it. You know what I'm saying? Like, Tay Rock 2 1, Daylight's not beating him on a big stage. But smaller room changes the complexity of everything. Like, it just, it just really, really, really transforms the whole battle because you don't have the effects, the crowd, you know what I'm saying? The big reactions, the bing, 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 Don DeMarco. Well, I don't even know if Don DeMarco's around anymore. I don't know if they brought this nigga to the New Deal or whatever the case may be. I don't know. But he don't got the big effects. You don't got the big lights behind it. Um, I tell you what, Daylight kind of has to win, though. He kind of has to win because when you get a rollout like he got, a welcome bag, and a, he's like the, the fucking, he got his own flyers and shit. And if he comes back and gets smoked, then it's like, my nigga, you could have stayed where you was at. But we're going to talk more when we talk more about what we talk for. Salute to the subscribers. That notification gang. Make sure you follow me on Twitter, at By The Fly. Um, and salute to my man, Showtime SP. Uh, once again, phenomenal work that he did in that B-Dot versus uh, Saga recap. <laughs> he went crazy. But uh, we'll be back today. You already know what to do and what it does. So you got to ask for the butts. To the Batmobile. Slim set. Vegas, Vegas, Vegas true. Drowning the lights while I stare. I've been on vacation too long. Nay, girl, I'm solo in here. Vegas, Vegas, Vegas true. They show me love of the year. Let champagne rain from the clouds. While she blow smoke in the air. Vegas, Vegas. Drowning the lights while I stare. I've been on vacation too long. Nay, girl, I'm solo in here. They show me love of the year. Let your paint rain from the clouds. While she blow smoke in the air. When they say I'm tripping, I am. Vegas trip flight overseas. Means that I'm solo again. Means that I'm likely to leave. Trees often blow in the wind. Trunk drunk providing my speed. Your roots never show through the skin. Vegas, Vegas, Vegas true. Better act like you know. Vegas. Better act like you been to. Vegas. Better act like you go. Vegas. 